they rub this in your face. Okay, inside the cube is where we're all at. Your, your soul, like the soul is the sun above your head. The sun is the sum of all the souls inside the matrix at any given point. That's what the sun is focusing down upon us is the collective consciousness of the whole and it has its own divine spirit it's when i say goddess worship okay i'm telling you that you're not supposed to fight with your wife or your girlfriend and you, you can never win so just let them always win and what i'm saying is that goddess worship is like uh, your mother-in-law, you make sure that, like, when I pick stuff off the ground in front of, I make sure I bend, I bow down to them. I, I, I mean, I lay it on thick because what I'm telling you is that these are like key things. I look into the sun, I speak my intent, I ground out with the grounding mats, or I put my bare feet on dry soil, and these are the types of things I do. I'm only two cycles into this blood over intent. I spilled my blood over my intent on 12 24 2013. I published the video and it'll be 1080 days next Christmas. And what I'm telling you is that it started with looking at the sun and speaking my intent which led to me getting the idea to write it down on paper do it on video and publish it to my channel on, on, on the ethernet and now here I am and I can see everything so clearly it down your intent you don't know how you're gonna like people say this blood over will thing you say i will do this but you don't know how you're gonna fucking do it you, yeah. you yeah, intend to do that. some i don't know how i'm gonna do certain shit but i intend to do it so i know that these demons like i tell you i don't care if it's a demon an angel a god or whatever it is they don't have one of their own to spill up this has to go you gotta be the most powerful substance in the universe is your is your blood it's your you, it's a blood sacrifice i don't care if it's just a little pinprick if it's a boo boo from work you've written down very specific shit that if somebody picked up the piece of paper they would phonetically sound out of their fucking mouth why is that to be my whatever it is you fucking wrote down you know what i mean for any you to write anything past that it doesn't make any sense i i tell you clear up i only write very specific. I intend to bring forth heaven to read the run. Get everybody to life. Pass into Garvey. Forgiveness for their filthy souls. For you to go past any of this type of shit, I'm telling you is the devil. <laughs> Nobody around me would think to write anything other than the shit I told. Them. Because it's got to be completely selfless. The proper application of this force is selfless. What I'm saying is it's like this virus it's not i don't have a language virus when somebody around me who you consider to be important like a boss a wife a friend or whatever when they see how it what can i get they, they get my head my i bow down like i'm a tiny fucking person you know what i'm saying what I'm is i literally do what i bow down before people that are around me and i give them this type of focus of don't you dare ever say i love you around me again. Say this, I'm gonna fucking shove it. Everybody around me already know what it means to say that shit. In reverse, it, 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 it's like, you know what I'm saying? People around you don't know that shit. They're all blank with virus stuff. They have monkey virus. They really think you want to fall for the spaces of monkey. They, they genuinely believe that they're an accident. They, there's no way that they can grasp the reality. Uh, the real reality. Like, when I say, you still think I'm fucking crazy. And I'm telling you, the devil. Who's standing on God's what? Lord, 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 is it? The Holy Spirit. Uh, yeah. The only reason I can see this shit is because I made a blood sacrifice. And now, I'm allowed to see it. It's like, at this point, it becomes a funnel. We're being called home. 
I'm gonna be like the first brain that goes through the fucking tunnel, the funnel, and then everybody's gonna come pouring through. It's gonna be like an avalanche where nobody can stop. It's not that it costs you anything. I'm gonna get myself to the location in a nice new ship with the word anybody. And then with that power, that nobody could step across the gate first. If they could have done it, they would have done it already without asking you for a fucking thing. So, for you to go, like, it, what I'm saying is that, this is it's a hot day and you don't look at the sun and speak your intent, that's, that's your mithra up there. That's Apollo. That's, that's the great <laughs> I'm telling you. That's that mythical being right there watching us all, paying attention, taking notes, taking fucking names. I'm telling it's like, picture yourself, it's a, it's like a record with, the sun is like the needle on the record, and you know, it's playing a specific tune, and that tune is being played because somebody stepped up and is saying very specific shit to that sun right now. Like I said, I hope everybody plays dumb and plays stupid. It's just, I don't see how anybody can not play stupid. They don't have any chance of catching up to this intelligence at this point. They still have to get over the hump that they're not an accident and they're not floating in a vault through space as a monkey and that there is an exit, that there is a prize. You know, I mean, for them to even grasp this kind of stuff, they still gotta come to terms with the flat earth type shit and they don't. And that every compass is attracted to the opposite. So the north side of a compass is seeking a south pole. You know what I mean? This, this type of stuff, you know, they're worried about 5G cell towers and shit. What the fuck? I'm just sorry. You know. I, I just don't see how people can get there like any 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 other way besides the divine one. They have viruses. You're gonna to need to eliminate your viruses first because you know you have this. Like like when I I, I remind myself and this should flip people up because I say you know. This drinking of the vagina blood, I, I remind you often, it's the elixir of immortality. It gives you the eyes to see shit nobody's gonna see, so you know, that flips you out. Yeah, that's where it's all going. And it flips a lot of people, and I want to, yeah, because look. Nobody's gonna go, uh, people get flipped up, I know it flips you out. I mean, come on. I know it flips you out. How is that flipping you out? This is the elixir of immortality with healing stiff, those all other. This concept of having to harm people to bite their neck or No, you need to be in some sort of, you know, holy type of relationship with another person. It's like the cell. It's like a cell split, you know, it's it one cell and it puts it to it, you know what I mean? It creates, and it, it, it expands. This is like, what I'm saying is that there's something mythical about this whole thing and people don't even want to research it. It, it, it makes it, it was, it was reserved for kings and, you know, someone who would be stepping up as Satan. This is the type of thing that's revert, reserved for Satan. So when they show you Satan with the, the fangs and shit, what I'm telling you is that, you know, this is the funniest shit. You know, when people go online looking to how to become a vampire. It's only meant for, like, Satan to laugh. Did you not be laughing? You're fucking, after you learn this shit, how could you not be laughing? Why would somebody harm someone else with all this? Women out there bleeding through their vaginas, this mystical stuff. Your neck doesn't bleed out mystical shit. I know you donate your blood and shit, but it's not the same thing. And what I'm saying is that we're going to be bathing in this vagina blood of the earth. This is not an accident. The fact that, that I was brought down this road to begin with shows you something. That if I'm telling you about it, you know, and showing you how ridiculous people are that that they would be flipped out by this doesn't make any sense. I mean, you never went down to your girlfriend that time of the month. I mean, this is like crazy stuff. So when you see, like they say, Jewish people or whatever, they it's like you can't have sex with your girlfriend for seven days after her period so that she's purged of this, what they consider to be like a horrible mess coming through her. This is like the grossest thing to me that they would even suggest this type of shit. How could you, I mean, they, it's just everything that you've ever been told is a lie. So this. It's just like everybody's so, I'm telling you, there's no way anybody can catch up.